Welcome to Jukebox Comics, where you'll see comic book hauls, things comic book related, and stuff I find interesting. So sit back, relax, and enjoy today's show. Hey everybody, welcome to Jukebox Comics. My name is Brandon. Today I'm not going to be doing a comic book haul or anything like that. Today's video is going to be on how not to store, protect, and display your comic books. I have six different ways of how not to protect your comic books, four different ways of how not to store them, and two and a half different ways of how not to display them. We'll start off with how not to protect your comic books. The first way of how not to protect them is just no bag, no board. That's the easiest, simple way of how you should never store, protect, or anything to do with your comic books. Um, they can get damaged, everything. It's, it's just not, don't do it. Don't do this. Second way of how not to protect them would be just throwing it in a beat up old bag with no blackboard, just thrown in there like that. Third way. This may look normal. Um, there's a board, there's a bag, but that bag is probably around 30 years old. I'm gonna call this braining because it looks like brains. So this is a brained bag. And if I take the board out, all the ink that was on the back of that comic book is is just eating its way through this board. You can see it literally says the Punisher right here and if I look at the back, that's what it is. So don't put your comics in old bags. If they're old like this, just replace them. Put new bags and boards. Fourth way, <laughs> you're, I've seen this happen numerous of times, uh, people, Put their comic books in their bags but they put the board in backwards so the acid side the acid cover side is actually facing the back um, don't do that that's just not doing anything good for your comic books whatsoever next way of not <laughs> this this just never ever 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 do this put it in a bag but just use a random piece of cardboard. That's just not not a good idea. But like, this is the cardboard I use just to throw in there. Um, don't do that. It's it's it'll eat away at your comic book because there's no acid protection or anything. It's just not not good. And the last way to how not to protect a comic book is throwing it in a freezer bag uh, <laughs> with just a random piece of cardboard. Just don't. That's. I've never seen this. Actually, you know what? I have seen this maybe once at a flea market, but just don't do it. It's just not good. Next, I have different ways of storing your comic books and how not to store them. So the first way of how not to store your comic books would be this, just throwing them in a short box. I don't recommend doing that. And then the second one would be this way is just putting them in your short box and throwing them in your basement under your stair. So that's just, it's not well ventilated, not just, it's not a good spot for them. And the next one would be throwing them in a file folder and a random box on the floor. This looks like a good spot. Now, how you should never, ever, ever display your comic books like this. It would be tacked up on the wall. No bag, no board, just tacked. And then the second one, well, you should never do this, 
but some people would do this just to have reading material in the bathroom. So don't put it in your bathroom or bad things will happen. If you follow these rules, you'll, your comics won't end up looking like this, just you know, having a tech, or coverless. That's, that's another thing that will happen if, if you don't bag or board them. Uh, the cover will just fall off and you'll, you'll just, it's not going to be good. Obviously, using it as toilet paper is, is not, a, not a safe way of doing it. and but falling in the toilet, you'll get water damage. Do yourself a favor and buy some backing boards that are acid free, whether it be full backs, half backs, or just like your normal things. And make sure you buy bags that are 100% acid free. Do yourself a favor and do that so this doesn't happen to you. All right guys, hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching.